Right, boys, welcome back to the channel. Big games today. We've got Boa Vista in the cup. We've also got Firenze. I think it's Firenze or Firenze, second in the league. Let's get into it. Make sure you smash a like on today's video for me. Subscribe if you are new. If you are new. Big, big games. Well, the Boa Vista is a bonus, but it'd be so good to, to qualify getting so close and hopefully help us out financially financially, and, and get a, if we get a half-decent cup draw, you never know. All right, guys, let's get into it. Call me arrogant because what I, I'm saying is true. I'm European champion, so I'm not one of of the bottle. I'm a, I think I'm a special one. So since last episode, um, we've actually played Boa Vista 2-0. We, we got taught a bit of a lesson, to be honest. We got battered throughout. We need to be careful today of, of how we how we play. We've played Benfica 2-0, uh, Cover de Pi 2-0, uh, Matteo Miaelo getting involved. Sagotta winning, we're winning 4-2. Sagotta getting a hat-trick. Sagotta getting another one there. Ollie Young's getting on the score sheet again. Ducks spin off it a little bit. and um, We've rotated the strike force a little bit as well. Ducks had a, a game out. Um, Maya's played up front, uh, Yakubu, so everyone's everyone's keeping fresh and fit. So two massive games today. We've even got Sporting after that. We are six points clear. Firenze have got a game in hand. Um, so it be interesting to see if, if they get that game in before us. Will they get that in before us? Maybe. Yeah, they will. They're playing on the Wednesday before us. So that's good. So we'll... We'll have a real good indication of how the league is going to be set for the second half of the season. We're approaching halfway point. Yeah, we're approaching halfway point. Seventeen. Yeah, we're ne we're nearly at halfway, and we're we're looking we're looking strong. We are looking strong. Right. The state of play is, I think it goes on goals scored. A goal difference, goals scored. Okay, so we've got a little bit of an advantage over Benfica, but I think of seven. We've just got to be careful that Benfica can easily smash for Malakau and then Boa Vista, Boa Vista beat us by two or three, and then we're in a little bit of trouble. So we're just going to knock it on to positive today. We've got a couple of injury suspensions. Yakubu's injured, Silva's injured, Sané, but Yakubu's going to be a big miss. Um, so we're going to go, obviously, Meyer and Duck can go up front. Ferrero can come in on the right-hand side. Good thing about these, they all can play in different combination, combinations. We've got Indai to go in there, so the squad is looking pretty bloody good. I've got a couple of people that are just struggling a little bit injury-wise, so we'll just go Diaz out, Sosa in. Martins is struggling as well. Have we missing Wadja? Wadja's there, he's fit, so Wadja can come in as well. Perfect. Everyone else is looking pretty fit and healthy, so it's said it's Boa Vista first. Right, here we go, first, quiet first, let's get latest scores up. Keep our eye on the Benfica game, making sure they're not smashing for Malakau. That's first opportunity of the game over the bar. Clivert has got, they, they must be playing a strong side today, Benfica. They obviously want to qualify. I suppose not qualifying from this group would be, I imagine, quite embarrassing for them. All right, Sauer, free kick. Sorry, corner kick. We've cleared. We're going to break it. We've got Mayu has got a little bit of pace. Duck's just running off him. Mayu's going the whole length of the pitch by himself. He's hit it. I'm trying not to scream too much because Ralph is in the next room getting settled, so get in. What a strike from Maya, the youngster. He's eighth of the season. He is our replacement for Duck. And at the moment, he's playing up there. He ran and he ran and he ran. And he absolutely thunderbasted it. Past the goalkeeper. 1-0. What a start. At least it gives us that advantage. Yeah, we might end up losing the game, but it just means that our goal difference is going to be one better. But that's been soon like Soonly. Soon cancelled out by Boa Vista. 1-1. Coming up to half time. No highlights since the goal. Benfica have gone to two. Just say go grab a goal. It's fifth again. Our game's been pretty much 50-50. Right, they've got another corner. Let's defend it. Defend it. Defend it. We've got a little bit lucky. We blocked it on the line. Pesheshel, the captain. If they start racking up three, that's where we've got to be careful. Andrew Sosa with it. Maya's there. Oh, just top of the bar. Benfica still two. We're just going to go on cautious. Benfica three. Okay. Ruben Loftus-Cheek. But we're going to see this out, boys. 
We're getting a point anyway. We've qualified. We've knocked Benfica out of the cup. That surely won't do their manager a favour. Just like Josie in his early days, we're making headlines. Trachinio does it again. We've qualified with against three teams from the top tier as well. Oh, money, money, money. Nice bit of money as well. £112,000. That will do very nicely. Now semi-final. Loser gets another 187,000. So with ticket money and extra bits, it probably means... Oh, we've got fucking Porto. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. But 100, we're looking at 500,000 probably extra that we've got from this. So we'll take that. I wonder if we get... Don't never tells you in the game, does it? It'd be good to know if, if we get any money from the Porto game in terms of ticket revenue. And maybe look, check the finances before the game. Right, on to Firenze. They've got a game, I believe, on Wednesday against Sporting. Big game, because they're around so like third or fourth in division. Sporting B, so we'll see how that gets on and see where it leaves us for the big way game. We are away from home. Right, here we go. Sporting B in Firenze. Firenze, 1-1. One, one. Okay, so that means we've got a five-point gap they've got a five point gap over Tondela as well so we could really open it up with a win here just don't get beat at the same time but a win would be magical I think we're gonna we're gonna go back onto attacking you know we're gonna go back onto attacking right and we're back big change Yakubu's fit so he's coming in he's replaced uh Ferreira who's dropped to the bench and that means Matteo Maia will go out wide Yakuba and Duke up front, and unfortunately, Revan is suspended. Our best centre half suspended, so Claudio Silva is coming in and he's not great. Sene, probably my third choice, is he's out injured. So, yeah, we'll see. We've, we're going attacking now. We want to get at these. Duke's picked up an injury straight away, so got a corner, cleared. We've got plenty of options. That's the good thing. We've got this team, especially attacking wise, we've got so many options. Maya. Players can play in two and diff three different roles. Aziz, so got us Yakubu. Just leave it. I leave Duck. He's picked up a little bit. Right, Enrique cross. Good save from Tiago Pereira. He's gone long with it. So got her. We're going to break here. We've got four in attack. So got her. Is he going to go himself? He's hit one. Bloody hell. That was way off. Duck's picked himself back up, which is good. So we have got young Porto on the bench as well. Ferraro can come on. Maya Pachecho. That's poor. Get there. No. They're going to have their first little go at us. They are second in the league, boys. So they're going to be absolutely no mugs. Cardoso has put them ahead. Disappointing because we've started pretty well. And we've just not done that final little pass. Okay. 20 gone. They've got a corner. Cleared. We're breaking here. Yakubu. He's got the pace. Who's up there with him? I think it's probably Duck. He's going to go himself. Yakubu. Oh, good strike. Good save. Went near post. He should have gone far post. I think he was actually up there with Sagota. Right, Sagota with a corner. Deep on. Duck's there. Handed a back across goal. I just needed someone else to tap it in. Sagota again. Corner. It's a deep one. Everyone's missed it. Let's get there first. Get there first. We haven't done. Wadja. Into Zagotta. Yakubu. Into Ducky. Oh, he's put it wide. Big chance. Ducky's struggling, boys. He's going to have to come off, you know. He's gone back down to yellow. So we're going to go Maya up there. And then we have got Ferraro on this side. Maya's in brilliant form. Right. Nice pass from Pereira. Out to Pachecho. Wadja's got involved. He's going to slip him. No. No. He fucking lost it. When he just had to do was pass it. Maya's done well. Just put one into the little channel for Sagotta to get on the end of. Cross. Ferraro's there. What, have we had three big chances in this first half? They've had eight shots, every single one on target. Right, just before half time, we've got the ball. Ducare. Indai. Wadja. That's not great. We're going to get the seconds? No. Ambrose. Cardosa's in again. Cardosa's in it over. 4v1 there, boys, and no one tracked his run. Right, half time. 
Hands on hips. I expect a little bit more. Much more in this second half. Just need to take our chances. Right. Midfield boys are struggling. So let's get Ramirez on to start with. Right, Diaz, Fernando. Come on, stay in the game, boys. Enrique, he's thought he was going to go down there for a second. Russia, stand. <laughs> Fucking hell. Are we destined to give away a penalty? We've blocked it. And then we've survived. Yakubu's struggling, so we're going to go. We're going to go the youngster Porto. And we're also going to. Oh, we can't do any more. Brilliant. Come on. Right, they're breaking. Enrique's shit going down the line. Are we going to get a cross to him, boys? Oh, he's getting fucking sent off, isn't he? No. Free kick. It's a weird highlight. I think it's going to finish 1-0, you know, boys. Corner. Cleared. Get there first, Ferraro. <sighs> fucking hell. An opportunity to break, then. Get there. There's a break on if we can win it. We're not going to win it, though, are we? Fatty. Claudio. Here we go. Porto. Slip him. Slip him. Slip him. Maya. Into Zogota, our main man. That could be valuable. There's no VAR. Onside. 1-1. One, one, 89th minute. What a result this could be. Porto did well. Sagotta, brilliant finish. We're going to see it out. We've got ourselves a point. We've left it late, but what a comeback. Point in the bag. I think that leaves us, what was the difference? Like five points, was it? Everyone's played 16. We're nearly halfway through the season. We are 10 points clear of third place. Remember, Sporting are one of those teams as well, but they can't even go up. And then there's a massive gap. We've just got to keep away from this, haven't we? But we want to go up as champions. We're now looking like we want to be champions, not just promotion. Champions, considering we're predicted to finish 17th, we ain't doing bad. All right, guys, let me know down in the comments. Would you like me to come back for Porto? Where is it? Oh, it's there. Oh, dear. Let me know down in the comments if you'd like me to come back for the Porto game or would you like, because it's going to be a difficult one. Do you want to see us against Porto in the semi-final? Let me know down in the comments or would you like me to kick on further into the season? All right, guys, that is it. Thank you very much for watching. Smash a like on today's video for me. No wins, two away draws or two massive results in terms of money for the cup and promotion, championship, whatever you want to call it. Buzzing. Cheers, guys. See you later.